Hi, my name is Thomas. I'm an admissions intern and junior at Bennington College, and I study morally ambiguous characters in theater through acting, psychology, and performance. Now, I want to answer the question, why enroll at Bennington? And I think that the most successful tours also answer the question, what about Bennington excites you? Tours are critically important because they help students discover the Bennington experience, not just hear about it. And that's why I'm so lucky to be a tour guide at Bennington is because that is what we do best here, discovery. I want to tell you a story about the first time that I discovered Bennington College. A couple of people had told me about it and I decided to take a tour here, but I didn't think I'd like it. My tour guide kept asking me what I wanted to do at Bennington. In every new room that I entered, I got an interesting idea about a cool theater project or a club to start. They also told me about how tight-knit the community was, how staff and faculty work really closely with students to make this place a better place. At the end of my tour, I was standing outside the library and someone walked up to me and asked me what I thought about the college. I told her honestly that I was skeptical about the community. I thought it might be a little bit of an embellishment. She said, all right, I'll keep that in mind. And I didn't think much of it until a few weeks later when I was looking on the website and I saw her picture labeled Bennington College President. <laughs> to say I was mortified is an understatement. I was sure that they had thrown my application right in the trash. Until I realized that she had appreciated my opinion and genuinely cared to hear what I thought. That's when I discovered Bennington. Now, I, I was skeptical about the education style as well, so I want to explain to you what the plan even is. The plan is basically what Bennington students do instead of majors. Bennington asks their students to study with breadth, tying in two or three or four different fields to answer a question that they have about the world or themselves. Like I said, I study morally ambiguous characters in theater, and Bennington lets me tie together acting, theater, and psychology to answer my questions about morality and the human experience in theater. I'm not confined by the structures or barriers of a major in a specific field. Bennington students break down barriers to discover what's on the other side. The community here functions in a similar way. The dorm rooms are actually colonial style houses with about 35 students all mixed together. Freshmen might be neighbors with seniors and musicians might be neighbors with biologists. We talk about each of our 18 houses as having distinct personalities. It's common to hear, oh, that's such a Bingham thing to do. Oh, wow, that is the Perkins vibe. And that's because our intentional communities are based on shared norms and values. My house, Bingham, has a lot of theater students and a lot of music students. We might be known as a little bit of a party house, but I think we have one of the strongest communities on campus. Kilpatrick House is loud and there's always music playing, while Franklin is the literature house that has poetry nights each week. Perkins is quiet but eccentric and passionate, while Fells is the definition of chaotic good. These houses are close and personal, but they offer you the space to create the community that you need. I love just sitting back in my common room and enjoying the deep conversations that Bennington students are prone to having. That's honestly where I discover the most about myself and the world around me. We have this program called Fieldwork Term 2. Basically, each student has an internship each of their four years in the January-February period. Students travel all around the world to find out what really working in their field is like. Liberal arts educations can be scary because sometimes it's hard to see what you'll be doing as a career afterwards. But at Bennington, you can't escape your freshman year here without having an interview, writing a resume, or getting up at 6 a.m. to sweep a stage floor for an improv workshop. Okay, maybe that last one is just me, but the point is that education here isn't just theory, it's practice. Maybe you love historical anthropology at Bennington, but working in a museum is completely the wrong career choice for you. You'll leave Bennington not just knowing what you love doing, but knowing how you're gonna do that too. I've loved my two fieldwork terms here. I've gotten to work at two community theaters and helped create shows that challenge the audiences to have a moral perspective shift. It's not just something I can write papers on, it's something that I know I can actually do. So. I've done a bunch of talking and I usually approach my tours with more of a conversational style. So I want to implore you to ask yourself, what do you still want to discover about Bennington? What about Bennington excites you? Now Bennington College is a place for students who can't help but explode with passion or yearn for discovery. If that's who you are, then Bennington needs you.